Hi guys, it is, let's see, 1.40 a.m. here in Connecticut. And I am doing a short haul video. I will do a burn video on this company once their stuff has cured. But I kind of wanted to go through it because um, I did receive this box a while ago. Um, but I believe she suggested to wait until Friday. There's two boxes. I'm waiting. Two boxes. I'm waiting till Friday to uh, finish curing. So I will do another um, scent video because I do have, I had a request for a burn video um, of stuff that I've burned because I mostly do cold videos, cold scents, cold throws, that kind of thing. Um, but I have been putting all my little packages aside of the things I've burnt. So I will burnt, melted, whatever. I hate to say burnt when I use, when I'm not burning, I'm melting. But anyway, um, but it's still called the burn video. So I am going to be doing one of those. And, but just for today, I'm going to post a haul video. And this is on, I got some stuck on my fingernail. I don't know if you can see this, hopefully. Okay. Lexi's Magical Sense. Now, this girl does not have a web page that you can order from. But if you can see at the bottom, very bottom, she does have a face group, a Facebook group, and it's www.facebook.com slash groups. I'm sorry, my hands are shaking. Slash what does it say? Slash. Oh my God, I can't even see it. Red. Red bows and tarts. Red bows and tarts. Okay. I'm not quite sure what that says, but I will post it below because I will find out for you and post it below. Um, so like I said, it says here, we offer tarts, handmade bows, and headbands. So I will, look, it's got her cute little, cute little puppy. Oh, look at that little, little guy. He's so cute. Um, so this is Lexi's Magical Sense. And like I said, I'll post all the information below. I'll find out exactly what the Facebook group is. You'll have to join it to get more info, but, um, I will put all the information below. But I've had this box. And I'm going to see if I can find. Let's see what I can find. Oh, I'm on, I'm on my wrong page here. I have a couple pages going on. Um, let's see if I can find. The exact name. See, I would normally want to say Lexi, but I don't think it's Lexi. Um. Yeah, Lexi's Mystical Sense. It's an open group. Um. So she doesn't have a page. Oh, it's Rad Bows and Tarts. Rad bows, like rad, like those bows are so rad. Rad bows and tarts. So that's the name of the group. Uh, well, it's Lexi's Magical Sense is the name of the group. But, um, so I'm just going to do a quick, like, um, cold throw video. Because she was asking me about this stuff. And I really haven't had a chance to go through it all. Um, like I said, I really wanted to do just one video, but I'll do this and I'll do a burn video along with it. So this is, um, the owner's name is Brittany, Brittany Fagley. 
F-A-G-L-E-Y. Um, and I saw, like I said, I saw her in a group. In fact, I came across her group. This is Lexi's Magical Sense. And she had this beautiful little basket. And it had all these things in it. And I was like, oh, that's so cute. I want one of those. I have to have one. So I said to her, I'm like, oh, you know, Brittany, do you have any more of that stuff? And she said, oh, I can make up another one for you. You know, so I said, oh, okay, cool, you know, whatever. Well, I didn't end up doing the basket. I ended up doing a um, regional flat rate box. But I figured I'll get more, you know, wax out of it. So I'll just kind of show you what's in here. Um, we have caramel apple. Look at the little camouflage foot. Um, what do you call it? Let's say footprint. Doggy print there. Or paw print. So we have caramel apple. Ooh. And that's really nice. I don't like apple scents. I'm not an apple scent person. But this is very, this is very nice. This is a nice crisp, crisp apple with camouflage and sort of like a, it's almost it's like a, let me catch that. Let's put it over here. Looks like a medallion of some sort. It's very nice. There's two discs in this one. So that is caramel apple. And I'm, ex excuse me, guys, if I seem tired. I am tired. Um, I've been trying to catch up on my videos today. But the next one is going to be hard to open because she has her, some of them she has her, her cards all taped, I mean, stapled to. So it's kind of hard to open. But this is Le Lexi's Magical Scents in Black Raspberry Vanilla. And this is just your typical scallop tart. Um, well, I can definitely pass these cards out because, she, like I said, she does have quite a few in there. So this is Black Raspberry Vanilla. Oh, and that is wonderful, too. I really, really, really should do a burnt video on this because these really seem cured they're really nice oh, this is just very fruity I'm not catching much of the vanilla right now but I'm catching a lot of the black raspberry but it's really really nice um, here we have a group of stars, like a whole bag of these little stars and banana nut bread. And that little paw print is just killing me. It's so cute. Look at all these little stars. So there's like one, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, there's about six in here. So if I use it in my little party light warmer, I would do probably three of these. Um, oh, that is amazing. Okay, so far, her scents are just amazing. Like, I'm so catching the banana, banana in this one. A lot of times with bakery scents, I don't catch it. And I'm catching a little hint of cinnamon. But normally it just smells sort of like a generic bakery scent. I don't know if that makes any sense to anybody, but, you know, you're like, oh, yeah. Oh yeah, bakery. But this one you can smell. Just this one smells just like my ex mother in law's banana nut bread. Oh, I can totally smell the banana. Love it. Like I said, I love banana scents. So that is awesome. Um, let's see. Then we have oh, Irish Billy's cream. Just don't look at these little labels. They're so cute. Um, I can't wait to burn some of this. Like I said, I'm definitely going to burn a couple in the next couple days and do a burn video. Oh, this is so strong, too. These are really strong, guys. Oh, it's so nice. 
Bailey's ice cream. Like, it just smells like just like it. It's like something that I want to put in my coffee. I used to love like Kahlua coffee or Bailey's ice cream coffee, like Irish coffee or Spanish coffee, whatever they call all the different kinds of coffees that had the um, alcohol in them. Oh, really nice Bailey's Irish cream. Um, and then we have let's see here. Oh, these are cute little hope ribbons, and she even put a hope ribbon on the bag. Little cancer ribbon there. These are caramel sticky buns. Now these are these again are really small. There's five of them in here, so I don't know five. What am I gonna do with five? Um, if there were six, like I said, I would do three and three. I don't know. Maybe I'll try two in my tart warmer, my little party light warmer, and see what happens. Um, I've been using the party light warmer a lot for smaller things. This kind of gives me a maple syrupy kind of smell more than a caramel, but it's really, really nice. Oh, love it. And like I said, super strong, um, super duper strong, really good. Um, this one again has her card on it, but this one is, you have a little piece dove. And it's strawberry bread. I love bread scents. I'm I'm coming to love. Ugh, I have to pull these cards all off. I'm coming to really love bread scents. Um, so strawberry bread. Now that's that's really nice. Um. I definitely still smell the strawberry, the bread part of it, the bakery part of it. I can catch a little bit. You know what it's, this actually smells like to me? I can catch a little bit of it, but this actually smells like fresh strawberry shortcake, like on a biscuit with whipped cream. You know, that's, I mean, that's how my mom used to make it on biscuits with whipped cream. And that's what it reminds me of. But it's called strawberry bread. But it reminds me more of like a strawberry shortcake on a biscuit. Really nice. Um, this one is another bunch of stars. And this is called Elf Sweat. And her labels are just too cute. Now, I don't know what Elf Sweat entails. So, again, this is one... Two, three, four, five, six stars. So I guess in the stars she put six. Okay, this is pepperminty. I'm not. I'm not sure what the other flavors are because I don't have a scent description in front of me. Um, I'll give you my more ideas like as to what the scents are when I do the burn video because I'm sure I'll get a um, scent list from her. But this is very pepperminty. There's also other flavors in it or flavors scents in it but I'm just not catching them right now or I don't know what they are put it that way I'm not a huge peppermint person this is interesting this is very interesting I don't know I don't know if this is a yes for me this elf sweat but um, we'll have to see what else is what else is in it um, this one is Oh, I'm loving these banana, banana cream pie. Look at the floor de lis. I love it. I want to go to New Orleans, New Orleans so bad, you guys. Why am I not focusing there? I really want to go to New Orleans. And what I love is so far she has not celloed any of the labels, so I can just open them right up without um, ripping any labels. This is nice. This is a little lighter. Oh, this smells just like banana cream pie, guys. I I am so impressed when scents smell like what they say they're supposed to be. You know, when you get a scent and you're like, okay, banana cream pie, and you're like, um, I smell crust. I smell maybe some cream, but I don't smell banana at all. Not with this one. Banana cream pie. 
oh my god, it's so yummy. It just reminds my aunt makes the best cream pies. She makes coconut cream pies, chocolate cream pies, banana cream pies. She makes all those for holidays. Oh my god, this is so good. This is really, really good. Banana cream pie. Again, little stars in this set of six. Okay. This one is in bubblegum. And this has these these hearts are really cute. There's one, two, three, four, five. Again, there's five. I'm a stickler for even numbers. Guys, I don't know why. That way you could do two and two and two if you want, or just three and three. I don't know. With five, it's like, what do you do with the leftover one? I don't know. OCD kick in, kicks in. Oh. Oh, my God. I have looking. I have been looking. Here's a cute little. Look, it's got little kind of like glittery. There you go. Kind of like glittery, sprinkly things in it. But I have been looking for a bubblegum scent, you guys. I tried another vendor and they said, oh, bubblegum or whatever. It tastes just, smells just like hubba bubba bubblegum. You know, that like super hard bubblegum that you used to eat and it was a big rock. But you wanted to get the, car the cartoon out of it so you gnawed on that thing anyway. <laughs> what we used to do as kids, I swear. But this is absolutely hubba bubba bubblegum. This is, oh. Uh, amazing bubblegum scent. I'm so happy. I am so happy just to have, I will just purchase again from Brittany, from Lexi's Magical, what, I'm sorry, Magical Scents. Um, I will, do, I'll pur purchase again just for this bubblegum because I have not been able to find a bubblegum scent that is actually a bubblegum scent. Scent. Okay, this is, look at the little turtle. Oh my god, these labels, I love them. Love them. These are two little, like, snappables. Like, you can snap these things in half, you know, and get, like, four out of it. Or, I mean, they're not that big. So, I don't know how much you're actually going to get out of them. But this is in Citrus Punch. Um, but there's these little snap sticks that everybody's kind of coming out with now. I'd probably snap it in half and put both of them in my little warmer. Ooh, but this is nice. This definitely has grapefruit in it. And I'm thinking melon. Okay, I look like I have a mustache right now. <laughs> um, I think I'm smelling grapefruit and melon. But, I, but again, I'd have to check the scent list. Um, and I don't have one from her right now. But like I said, when I do the burn video, I will give it to you. But this is really nice. I mean, I'm, I have a, I'm not a grapefruit kick lately. I'm not a melon person because I'm really allergic. So now it makes me kind of nervous. Like when I touch it, if there's going to be an issue, I don't really know. But, but these are really cute. This is in what's called Tide. So I'm assuming it's a laundry scent and it's in these Starbursts. I like these and I don't know why. I really don't. I tend to like them more than the scallops, and I don't know why. They're just more aesthetically pleasing to me. I have no idea. I mean, you know, it doesn't make a bit, of, a bit of a difference, but yeah, this is definitely tied, like nice, clean laundry fragrance. But you know what's good about this one? I mean, it's, you know, soapy. But you know what's really good about this one is it's not too overpowering. Like, it's very strong. These scents, guys, are really, really strong. Um, again, I should put a, just put a card up here. I'm sorry. So I don't have to keep looking over there. Well, Lexi's Magical Scents, the owner is Brittany Fagley, I want to say. F-A-G-L-E-Y. I want to say Fagley. But if I'm pronouncing it wrong, I apologize. I've done it in the past. I will do it in the future. And you can mispronounce my name if you'd like to. Salazzo is not very easy. But this Tide fragrance is really nice because it's not too flowery or perfumey or overpowering. 
So I really like this one. That, that's a good one. Really like that one. Um, this one is spiced. Where we go? There we go. Spiced crumb cake. Oh, kitty. Oh, I hate that. My mouse goes off and my screen goes off. Spiced crumb cake. It's a little kitty. Now, anything when it says spiced, I get a little nervous just because I don't do cinnamon scents. But, oh, but this is really nice. See, spiced kind of fools me because it could be cinnamon or it could be like nutmeg and that kind of stuff. And this is, oh my God, you know what this smells like? Those hostess cakes that had like all the little crumbs on the top. Oh my God, those are the best. Those crumbs, those crumbly crumbs on the top of those hostess crumb cakes. <gasps> oh my God. It's just what this smells like. And you guys, like, like I said, on cold throw, these things are amazing. And I was going to let these cure till Friday and I don't even need to do that. So my burn video will probably be up well, today's, tomorrow will be Wednesday, so it probably will be up on Friday, but on cold throw, these things are just amazing. And there's, and this is really cute, too. So it's just a little round dome shape with a little flower on top of it. Very adorable. Oh, I can't wait to burn this stuff. I cannot wait. In fact, I think she asked me the other day, she's like, well, what do you think of them on cold? And I'm like... I really don't want to do that. I want to wait. But ooh, this, now this right here. Okay. If you look at this. Where is it? Okay. It's called Grapesicle. Now, if you look at this, this is the size tart that I need for every, I don't know how many ounces this is. Oh, my hair is caught on it. Nope. It's not my hair. It must be somebody else's hair. Um, this is the size tart I need for all my warmers. It needs to be need, need to be nice big discs like this. I mean, this thing's heavy. This is this is a really good size tart. Um, so I'm gonna have to ask her about more of these when I order diff the different scents. I'm gonna order ask her if she can send them all in these things because this is really a good size tart. But this is grapesicle. So I'm assuming it's going to smell like grapes. Look at this thing. It's like a hockey puck. This is awesome. Oh, this is really nice. It's like a grape popsicle. Really, really, really nice. Really strong, really potent. Not one of these have I gone like, oh, I can't smell it. Oh, so good. Brittany, awesome. And like I said, this, this right here, I don't know what you call it. Let me know, post below, what this thing is called right here. Hockey puck. I'm going to call it a hockey puck. So when I say, okay, I want a hack, I want hockey pucks in this fragrance and this fragrance and this fragrance. Now you'll know what I'm talking about. The hockey puck. This right here. Love it. Because this is, would be perfect for one of my warmers. Absolutely perfect. Because I ha tend to have big warmers. My warmers are big. They have the, the big bowls. Um, so little teeny thingies. Are cute, but they're not going to do really do me any good. Um, ooh, here we have a regular scallop in lemon chiffon. See, even these regular scallops uh, in my 18 watt, they're okay. Um, in my 24 watt, forget it. Actually, in my party light warmer, they might do okay too. Um, I may have to pick up a, one other one other warmer. But this is lemon chiffon. I I'm also on a lemon kick. I don't know why lately. Lemon anything lemon. <gasps> oh, this is so good. But you know what this is? This is like a. I get the tang of the lemon, which is to me, if if you're gonna give me a lemon scent, it better have that tang. Better have that kick. And I definitely get that. I don't know if I get a floral with it. Or it just could be like the lemon zest. 
I don't know, but it's a wonderful lemon scent. Wonderful, wonderful, wonderful. I hate when I get a lemon scent and it's just like there's no kick to it. There's no punch to it. There's no tang. I just can't stand that. Um, this one is called, this one, actually, this one broke, but this one's called Berries in Peach, which is really interesting. Um, one of the little scallop parts fell off. Ooh, let me see. Ooh, this is nice. Oh, God. This is really nice. The berries and the peaches mix like really, really well together. This is a really, really great fruity scent. There's not one. I usually do. I usually have a little pen here. And I do like a little Y or a little N or a question mark like for, okay, maybe I like it or yes, I like it or no, I don't like it. So far, I like all of these. Like them all. Um, this is cute. This is these are a little like see, you can even see through the thing the little sprinkles on it. Two little cubes in cocoa pebbles, which anything cocoa is going to be right at my alley. Now she did cello over the label, but I love her cello bags because it didn't it didn't rip it. Okay, I need this in a perfume. I need this Cocoa Pebbles, Cocoa Pebbles right here, in a perfume oil. So, Brittany, I'm going to be requesting that. You probably know nothing about perfume oils, nothing about body sprays or perfumes, but I have got to have this Cocoa Pebbles in a Just like Cocoa Pebbles, you guys. Not like Reese's Cocoa. Not like Captain Crunch Peanut Butter. Cocoa Pebbles right here, guys. Straight up. Wow, Brittany. And she was all worried, too. She was like, oh, well, make sure you like give it to me first before you post the video. Because in case you don't like anything. You know, she was like all nervous. Girl, you're hitting it out of the park, girl. Like, totally out of the park. You are, like, amazing me. Oh, okay. Here's another one in Citrus Punch. Well, so that's cool. I'm not going to open this one again, but that's cool because I did like that scent, and there are more of these breakables. So now I have four of them, so that will give me enough to, like, give a really good scent throw. Um, Here are two scallops. In, they look like they have like little sprinkles and ornamentation on it, whatever, in rain. And the only thing I'm going to say about, like these don't think, it's, I don't think these are going to really bother me. But I'm kind of over the sprinkle, not the sprinkles, the glitter guys. Because the only one that I can really clear the glitter off of really well is my party light. And that's because it's like ceramic all the way through, almost like an unfinished ceramic. The other ones that are like, um, what do you call it, like um, glazed, it's so hard to get that glitter off. It really, really is. I mean, it looks beautiful in the pot and everything like that while it's simmering, but I'm, oh, I'm, I'm just really over it. I, you know, I love it when people can request no glitter because I always request, we, I always request no glitter. But this is in rain. Oh, and the, even this is really, really nice. Now, rain should be a really soft scent, you would think. This is just a really nice, green, herbal, wonderful scent. And there's nothing. It's like raining outside. I'm just listening to it on the air conditioner as I'm speaking about it. It is a wonderful scent. Really nice herbal green spa like scent. Rain. Wonderful. And I guess I just can't keep chuckling to myself because she was, like I said, she was so nervous. She's like, oh my God. I don't know. I don't know what I'm going to do. Like, make sure you let me know first. 
Okay, this is Montego Bay, and again, in my cute little starburst that I like. Now, I love the name Montego Bay. Sometimes you can't find the, the opening to these things. I'm like, I feel like a little challenged because I can't find them. Montego Bay, I don't have a scent description to this. Um... Okay, this one's very different. Um, I don't know. Montego Bay, Brittany, please post it below because I have no idea. None. What I'm smelling here. I mean, I think I'm smelling some greens, um, but I'm not sure. I think I'm smelling some greens, but I don't really know. So Montego Bay, if you could post it below, let me know. Um, oh, these are cute. Oh, these are puppies. Oh, I have to pull these out. Um, these are so cute. But this is in Sprite. Now, I'm thinking maybe Sprite the drink, right? The soda. I could be off. But I just have to pull these out because these are so adorable. Look at these little puppies, you guys. Hello. How cute is that? Look at that little sucker. Come on. Oh my God, he's so cute. He's like begging. He's begging to be melted. And yes, this is like a lemon lime Sprite soda. Oh my God, you can like almost like smell the fizz too. Like the effervescence to it. Ugh. That smells so nice. Love it. Love it, love it, love it, love it. I've never had a Sprite scent before. That's awesome, Brittany. Awesome, awesome. Sprite scent. Um. Oh, here's another berries and peaches. Yay. I'm so happy that I got duplicates because, like I said, um... This is in the stars, too, so the, like the little ones, so I can throw more in my warmer. Oh, here's some more doggies. This is in, these guys got a little broken up, just a little bit. And pink sugar, oh, look at the little doggie on the label. How cute is that? This is in pink sugar. Um, oh, I cannot wait to melt these, you guys. Pink sugar is so amazing. It reminds me of cotton candy. But like more. It's cotton candy but more. Like I don't know what. Cotton candy plus something. Oh, It is so nice. Just such a sweet little scent. And this little puppy look at. In pink. How cute is that? Who wants this right? He's just too cute. Oh, but this pink sugar is amazing. Oh my God, Brittany. Seriously, girl? Seriously. Like, you are blowing me away. I mean, seriously. Like, I was so tired. I was like, oh God, I have to do this video. Like, I really got to do it. I should at least do the cold video. Blowing me away, you guys. Lexi's magical sense. Like I said, I'm going to post it below. These cold throws are absolutely insane. I cannot wait to melt this stuff. I just cannot wait. Oh, another hockey puck. This one is in lemon pound cake. I love these hockey pucks. Love them. I don't know how many ounces they are. If you can let me know, Brittany, below. I'm just going to call her Lexi. I knew that Lexi must be her dog. The little cute doggy on the thing. Oh, this is so good. Lemon pound cake. It's. I'm hungry. It's making me hungry. It's so good. It's like a lemony, buttery pound cake. Like a, lem you know, like a golden pound cake with like lemon drizzle on it. Ooh, 
so good. But I love these pucks. Like I said, they're not called, they're probably discs, whatever you call it. I love them. I love the size of these things. These are just perfect for me to plop into my warmer. Perfect, perfect size. No questions asked. No hemming and hawing. No, how many am I going to throw in? How many am I going to keep? No, just throw one of those suckers in and you're all set. Okay, here is some of these, more of these, like, little sticks. These little, oh my god, why does my screensaver keep going off? Ugh, annoying. In orange sherbet, or orange sorbet, I'm sorry. I don't know why I said sherbet, but look at the labels. They're so cute. Um, so these are these little breakaway sticks. Like I said, I probably would put, put both of these in my warmer, just because, like I said, I... But I don't know now with her scent throw. Okay, now this definitely is an orange sorbet. The orange, you can like, you know what this smells like? I mean, this is going to sound kind of weird to everybody. And I don't mean it to, and it doesn't mean anything derogatory. Because it's really good. Oh my god. It's like an orange sherbet, but it's like, it's like more orangey, less creamy. Like... You ever, like, peel an orange and throw it down your, your garbage disposal? You know what I mean? To make it smell really good, and then you turn the garbage disposal on, and, like, all you can smell is orange. Like, this is what it sm that smells like. Like, ugh. Like, fresh orange peel. Oh, my God. So, 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 so good. Orange sorbet. Lexi's Magical Scents. I'm just going to keep saying the name. Lexi's Magical Scents. Here's some more of these cute little... Oh my god, it's another one. Cocoa Pebbles. Guys, I'm not going to open it. I want to really bad. But it's got two little chunks in the in the um, package. I really want to open this so bad. I want to melt this and rub it all over my body. Because that's what I want to walk around smelling like. Is Cocoa Pebbles. Because, wow. It's amazing. Okay, Lexi's Magical Scents. I'm just going to keep saying it, guys, because, like I said, you're not going to be able to find it online. You'll be able to find it as a Facebook group in Rainbow Taffy. Let's see here. And again, these are the cute little stars. Six apiece, six to a bag. Guys... This is just like rainbow taffy. Like some people could stick something in a bag, right? And call it rainbow taffy and it could just be like smell fruity, right? And you'd be like, oh, okay, sure. That smells like rainbow taffy. No, no, this girl is not fooling. This is just like the boardwalk when they used to go to the beach, go to the boardwalk. You used to go to like the penny candy store. I know I'm dating myself. I so know I'm dating myself, but you used to go to the penny candy stores and you used to pick out all the stuff and oh my god, when you got the rainbow taffy. Just like rainbow salt water taffy. Absolutely. Absolutely like it. Wow. We have not had one dud in this whole pile. Guys, not one dud. Okay, here's two little sunbursts or Starburst, whatever you want to call them, in Beach Walk. Now, I know Yankee Candle has a Beach Walk, so I don't know if this is a dupe or not. Um, once I do the hot throw, I'll let you know. Because I will have a scent list by then. Oh, this is very nice. You know what? This is very perfumey, though. This Beach Walk is perfumey. It's, um... And I'm not big on perfumies, but it's very nice. It kind of reminds me like a cross between the Tide and the, what was it, like the Fresh Rain or whatever that was called. The Rain and the Tide, almost like a in between those two. So it's very nice, but I think there's definitely some floral in here. So... I still like it though. I mean, I still like it. Do I mean, is it one of my favorites? No, but I still like it. This cold throw is just knocking me out of the park. We got a couple left. 
There's one in Eskimo Kisses. And again, this is a sunburst, or two, two little sunbursts in Eskimo Kisses. This is interesting. I really wish I had a scent description. I should have gotten one before I did this video, but this definitely has like some tea tree oil in it. Tea tree oil, that's it. I'm probably, I'm like, yeah, that's it. I'm probably so wrong. But that's what it reminds me of is a light tea tree oil scent. Oh, it's very nice. It's like one of those um, almost like sinus reliever kind of kind of scents. It's nice. Tea tree oil. That's my guess, Brittany. That's my guess. Eskimo Kisses has some tea tree oil, tea tree oil in it. Let me know if I'm right. Because I'm probably not. You could probably go, eh. wrong, Chris. You're wrong. Because it happens all the time. Oh, here's another. I'm not going to open it, but here's another little stickies in orange sorbet. Those little sticks. I'm so glad she gave me some dupes. That's all, Not dupes, duplicates, whatever. Um, that's awesome because, like I said, then I don't have to, um, you know, be like, oh, I'm going to put this in my warmer. I'm not going to get a good throw. <clears throat> this is the last one, guys, in apple slice. Now, like I said, I'm not a big apple person. Did we do apple slice already? I want to say we already did apple slice. Yeah, we did. We did apple. We, there was another apple slice because this is your straight up Macintosh apple. Not like a Granny Smith. Straight up Macintosh apple. Nice red Macintosh. Or like a red delicious, whatever. I, no, it's a Macintosh. Like, I'm sitting here like I'm an apple expert, and I know what they all smell like. But this is a straight-up apple scent, and we did ha we did have another one in there. But this is really, really good. I mean, okay, guys, that was it for the cold throws. And let me tell you, every single one... Oops, no, I'm sorry, we got one left. Oh, how could we forget? And it's a disc. Here's one in maple pancakes. Maple pancakes. They'll make me some maple pancakes tomorrow for breakfast. I don't eat that. I don't eat that anymore, but that kind of stuff. <gasps> oh, my God. I can just, the maple with a little bit of bakery and the butter drizzling over it. Oh, oh my God. Maple pancakes. And it, again, in my little puck. I'm ordering these. I'm ordering more. I'm ordering I'm ordering so much so much of these. Now, I can't remember, to be honest with you, if I ordered these or if she gave these to me. But anyway, I'm not gonna put these away right now because that will just make too much noise. But I'm gonna hold up the card again. Lexi's magical sense. Okay? And look at that must be Lexi. Ooh, other side. That must be Lexi right there. So cute. Um we offer tarts. Handmade bows and headbands. Check us out in Facebook group. www.facebook.com slash groups slash rad, R-A-D, bow, bows, B-O-W-S, N, the letter N, tarts. I can barely read it. Yep. Rad, R-A-D, B-O-W-S, and Tarts. N, like the letter N, tarts. But anyway, I'll post it below. Brittany, I know you were dying and you're thinking, oh my God, you were all so, ner you were so nervous. No need to be, girl. This was absolutely, 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 I'm sorry, my ponytail is like a mess today. Absolutely amazing. The cold throw was insane. I will be melting some of these on Friday. I will post all the, your information below. I will be posting this. I think I'll send it to you first. I might get your email. I don't know what the easiest way to do it is because my videos tend to be a little long. But I'm definitely going to be throwing these some in my warmer. Um, 
to see what we get on hot throw because on cold throw, out of the park, girl, out of the park. For a company I've never heard of before who doesn't even have a, a vendor shop, it's amazing. We did all of our transaction guys through messaging and PayPal and she was so awesome. Everything came really quick and it was amazing. It really, really, really was. So, um, I'm just trying to see here. Flat rate box. Um, Yeah, so I'm going to try both in my 24 and my 18 watt to see which one works better. Um, oh, and these are all soy pair of blends. So, just so you know, um, this was, she gave me a box of 24 ounces or a little bit more. There was like about 20 or 25 different packs of tarts in it. Um, and she gave it to me for a good price, guys. So, like I said. And I opted out of the basket. The basket was really cute, but I wanted more wax. Um, so, Lexi's Magical Sense. Brittany Fagley. F-A-G-L-E-Y. Um, I hope, like I said, I hope I'm pronouncing that wrong. Wrong. I hope, I hope I'm pronouncing it wrong. I hope I'm pronouncing it right. I'm going to post all the information below. Got to try them out. Join the Facebook page, guys. She has knocked it out of the park. Absolutely. On cold throw, I have never, ever, ever in any of my reviews and anything I've smelled yet smelled anything this strong and this accurate in my life. So, A++++++, plus 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 plus, Brittany. And... That is all for me and my funky hairdo for tonight. I think this is my fourth, third, or fourth video tonight. I'm done for the night, but absolutely, Lexi's Magical Sense. I'll post the information below. Check it out. Amazing. Amazing. Thank you. Mwah.